Hey, we are back as I work on a Saturday here on uh, a little bit more of this comedy legs table and uh, I'm just getting ready to do these uh, these poles or pipes that are for the legs and uh, man I swear by this stuff I've used it for a few years now and it's called never dull it's really great and it comes it, I can't open it one-handed but it comes it looks like a big uh, there's like a big cotton ball and you just tear a piece of this off okay so it's wadding okay it's a wadding polish and you just take it over over this thing and even this one was done already but watch this I mean you'll get residue out of it just like that I wasn't even forcing anything on that so anyway this stuff is really great you do that you, you rub it over it and then just take another clean rag and polish it up and uh, so I'll come back to these uh, legs for this Hughes legs table in just a little bit here okay guys this is literally after just about f literally five minutes of my time to uh, polish these things up and boy this doesn't do it any justice here down here with this low light but uh, you kind of get the idea I left one of these undone so you can see this is how most of us magicians walk in with our gear okay from time not having time to do things and uh, our swords or other uh, steel things uh, aluminum all of it gets really dull after a while it uh, gets that horrible look to it that uh, that patine sometimes uh, the patina finish sometimes uh, which we don't want we want a nice crisp shiny look to our things and uh, our brand suffers because of it so these are the little things in your brand that a lot of people uh, as entertainers we don't think about because these are the things on the back burner we have too many fish to fry we have other things that are much more important that's true but anyway um, I'm not paid for this I, I just think it's a great resource uh, or a great tool that I've used for years and I wanted to share it with a lot of you illusion builders, a lot of you guys that are actually on the road, uh, because it is such a great, great, quick, quick, quick thing that should be in your uh, your tool ATA case or or whatever you have as far as your tools, because it's so easy. Here again, it's it that literally took me five minutes of my time just to shine those things up. So. Here again, it's all about presence, right? You want a great show, you want a great look, so why not take it and go all the way with this and uh, and use something like this? It's going to save you a lot of time, like never dull. So, wow, there's my commercial. I really hope they uh, send me some money for that. That'd be awesome. But <laughs> anyhow, still working on this uh, comedy legs table. Uh, it's a Hughes, a Jack Hughes table from England, and uh, refurbishing it and uh, stripping it off and all kinds of stuff. So all kinds of things going on here that I'm working on. But I thought you know that's a really great branding lesson that you guys can learn. Uh, if you haven't already, that, you know, we, we think of our logo, we think of uh, the quality of our show, we think of our look, but do we think of our props and what that looks like? So, at any rate, that's so important. So, there's your lesson of the day is it regard or as it relates to branding and uh, how all this fits in because here again branding is about the perception that people have about you it's a formed perception just like your show whether your show is good or bad they're gonna make that decision based off of what they see what they think and what they feel so there you have it so anyway um, I will talk to you later doodle what are you doing hey and that's my doodle dog back there just uh, hanging out with me so anyway thanks guys talk to you later and here's just a real quick afterthought. So anyway, those are uh, they're done. But uh, uh, this would also work on coins and things of that nature. But as I was sitting here doing this, I scoped the room and I forgot about this. But I've done this for years as well. And this is a great thing. Uh, you can see I have a just a bag of different stands and things like that. It's a little disshuffled at the moment. <laughs> but uh, anyhow, uh, here in my the bowels of my basement here, so that is what it is. At any rate, uh, this is, as you probably can already tell, is insulation like you use around uh, copper piping and things like that to, uh, to keep your, your pipes warm, okay? I've used this for years for my poles and uh, actually this this is for actually for my legs table uh, so just another uh, little afterthought for you as it relates to uh, to protecting your gear so thought you might like that so there you have it all right again uh, 
project continues, and I'm out. Let's just smile today. Let's just smile today.